Hi everybody! So today I'm going to do my Birchbox unboxing video for the month of January. So, the box this month was super cute. It's probably one of my favorite designs. It says, let's do this uh, purple cover with little confetti on the back. Um, Birchbox is a $10 a month subscription that sends you not just makeup, um, it also sends you skincare. Sometimes I even get food. I got, a, I got like a snack one time. I've gotten tea before, and what's really cool is usually you can select um, an option to put into your box. Like, they give you a choice of three or four, and you get to choose which sample you want added to your box, or you can just want to be surprised. And sometimes you can even choose a whole new box, which is really cool. So it gives you a lot of chances to do whatever you want to do with your box. And then every time you review a product, you get 10 birch box points when you review within the month that you have the box. And... 100 Birchbox points is $10 in the Birchbox store, which has really great products, things like Benefit, all the way to Stila, all kinds of different brands, and really great products. If my lighting changes, I'm sorry. I'm filming with my window today, and we have been getting rain off and on, so it's kind of cloudy, and then it gets bright, and it's just ridiculous. So, let's do this. We have, when I open it up, I have my little card here, 2015, let's do this. There's a 31 day challenge apparently. I'm kind of late in January for that, but alright. And here are the list of products I have. So let's go ahead and start going through them. I'll keep this here so I can use it as a reference. So the first thing I see is the Curl Keeper Ultimate Hold with Frizz Control. So this is Curly Hair Solutions Curl Keeper Gel. The full size is anywhere from $9.99 to $17.50 apparently, and it says that it's a water-based, never crunchy formula that fends off frizz and leaves curls silk sleek and shiny. And after styling, apply a small amount of gel to hair to reactivate smooth with wet hands. Um, it's a really good size of sample, so you can probably get a couple uses out of this, which is nice. I don't typically wear my hair curly very often. I have naturally wavy hair. Um, I might try it on that, but I might just give it to my best friend because she has super curly hair that she does like to wear curly, so these are really great products for me to give her. So, but this one is nice, like I said, good size, and I actually really like the packaging of this one. It's like a cardboard little squeezer, so it's really nice. The other one is another good sample size, and this is the Essential Elements Body Lotion. Uh, this one is Wake Up Rosemary Body Lotion. The full size is $19. It's a lightweight hydrator that heals dry skin and energizes with invigorating rosemary and mint. Uh, so let's try it out. Let's see. Ooh. I like the smell of herbs, and this smells really nice. It does smell a lot like rosemary. Ro rosemary. Rosemary. Okay, let's get some of this on here. And the sample size, once again, is really good. This is the kind of stuff I like to throw in my purse and use whenever I get lotion samples, I just throw them right on into my purse because I get really, really dry hands, especially during the winter. And with Lily, the kitten, I get little cuts from her uh, just playing. She doesn't try to use them on us, but they come out when she's playing, so I get little cuts that dry out. It feels, it's, it's kind of thick, which is nice because I don't like, like, there's only one moisturizer I've ever liked that had like a watery texture. I'll have to explain it on a favorites video because I love it. Um, but this is a really nice texture. It's not too greasy. And I really like the smell because it's like I said, it's very herbal and fresh, which I prefer over like florally, musky scents. I'm not too big on musk. All right, the next thing I see is the Key West Aloe Gentle Aloe Facial Cleanser, 30% aloe, triple action performance. Really decent sample size again, and it's in a bottle, which is nice. So it's good for travel. Just throw this in my bag. So like when I go to Colorado next two months from now. Or like when I go to Florida, I'm going to be taking things like this because it's a great way to use product. And this one is, the full size is $16.50, made with 30% aloe vera, with this foaming wash cleanses, calms, and rebalances skin. So this is it's perfect for sensitive skin. I don't have particularly sensitive skin, I'm just prone to breakouts, but I don't get like too red, I don't get like uh, splotchy from using product, so I just get breakouts. Um, but I'll definitely try this out and see how it works. And then in this little blue box, I have two products. I have first the Cynthia Rowley Lip Gloss in Sugar. It's a creamy lip stain. I will put it on my hand so you guys can see if I can get it open to find a little plastic spot that I can squish up. 
Oh, that's like four knocks getting into this thing. Um, while I'm doing this, the Cynthia Rowley Beauty Creamy Lip Stain in Sugar, the full size is $20, and it's a long-wearing stain from the New York City-based designer that gives unbeatable moisture and shine. I like the color. It's kind of like that mauve pink that's going around right now that's ridiculously popular. Okay, almost there. Ah, ta-da! It's a little lip gloss tube, which is nice. It's a decent size because I don't use too much lip gloss, so it's not like I'd be going through it like crazy. Um, but it's in a nice little tube with a little doe foot applicator. And the color, oh, it's kind of sheer, which is nice because I don't like my lip glosses to be like too crazy or anything. Except the dry cosmetic ones are really, really uh, pigmented. So let's see. Try and get a big enough swatch so you guys can see what kind of color we're looking at here. Sorry, my hand is a disaster from Lily, so it might look kind of gross. But this is the color here. So this is Sugar by Cynthia Rowley. Um, it looks like a really pretty non-glittery gloss, which is nice, kind of like super glittery glosses, to go over like my uh, like Velvet Teddy or my NARS Raquel, things like that. My Too Faced Perfect Nude Liner, which I absolutely love, something like that. Perfect. And the last thing in this month's box is the Miracle Skin Transformer Treat and Conceal by Cicera Mc McNamara, I would say. And it's Cover, Correct, Protect Miracle Concealer with Treatment Benefits. It's a little sample. It's a little tube, which is nice. They have really good packaging this month. I'm really impressed. And the full size is $36. It's a creamy, non-drying treatment that covers and helps get rid of blemishes and dark circles. And so I'll kind of put it on my hands so you guys can see. It's a little bit dark for me, but I might be able to use it on some things if I just correct it well. Because it's... I don't know if it comes in different colors or what. But... Either way, it's a really nice looking, it feels nice. It's nice and creamy. Um, it blends out really well. So overall, I really like this box this month. I had some really, really good products. Um, so go ahead and thumbs up, like this video, subscribe to my channel. And next I'm going to be doing an Ipsy bag unveiling. So you're going to see me all over again doing that one. So thanks so much again, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.